And chapter seven, page design. All right. This is an interesting page design. Look at this. So we've got, sorry about the glare guys. I'm trying to fix that. We got a vampire battle, it looks like. And cyborg, maybe, yep, yeah, cyborgs? And cowboy, cow women, cowgirl women? I don't know, but this is an interesting one. Uh, yeah, interesting one for sure. Somebody had to think of this. This almost looks like, what is this, like a, a weird vampire strip club or something? I don't know. It's what it looks like to me. <laughs> but, uh, so it starts out, the blank page is literally and figuratively your ta tabula rosa, blank slate. It's an empty space on which you can use your art to magically convert it into a page of a comic story filled with drama and excitement. So yes, yes indeed. And this is my girl again, Red Sonia. Oh yeah, get it girl. Kick through that glass. Yeah, go conquer the world in your <laughs> chain mail bikini. <laughs> I love that. Okay, moving on. Panel sequence. So uh, this looks, this looks kind of like Red Sonia here again, but uh, she's fighting like Jungle Jane or something. Wow, how cool is that? Oh, Jungle Girl, I almost had it. Red Sonia versus Jungle Girl. How cool is that? That looks like a fun comic. Two girls in bikinis having a, <laughs> having a battle. <laughs> um, let's see, panel sequence. You know, it goes through that, like how the panels start, like bam, 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 and then bam, 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 bam. You know, it goes into that location of figures on the panel. You know, like, uh, you know, yeah, this is, you know, way back, a little closer. You can tell they're like walking long distance, you know, by like, look how far they are here. And like, I can only imagine how far they've been walking. Panel sizes, you know, that's an, another choice to make. I like big panels for some reason, because I draw on small pages of, or small pieces of paper. I think that's why. Um, oh, this must be Jungle Girl, Red Sonya versus Jungle Girl again. This looks like a fun comic, actually. What is this, a dinosaur? And is this some kind of demon thing riding a dinosaur? How cool, Red Sonya just looks so interesting. Page turners, okay, so yeah, this, here's a page turner. So this is kind of like a cliffhanger. You, like, something exciting happens at the end of the page where, like, it makes you want to turn that page to see what happens next. And then, uh, <laughs> asymmetrical and inset panels. So it goes into some of that. I don't mess around with that too much. I'm, bo I'm, I'm boring, I guess. And then, uh, exploring the nine panel grid system. So this is, uh, you know, four panel grid, nine panel grid. This is kind of what my what I do is the paint like the square panels. Every now and then I'll do a few like slanted panels if I'm feeling adventurous. Um, nine panel. I I don't typically do this because it's just almost like too much of the same thing. Like, but I will. I do kind of stick with whenever I'm making my comic. Lately, I I do the three. Like I do in thirds. But then sometimes I'll do maybe just one big third, maybe I'll split the second one in half, and maybe I'll do three at the bottom or something like that. And, and I'll interchange those. But anyway, so he's talking about that. Here's the six panel grid, you know. There's a lot of ways to do it. These, this is kind of like a, I guess, like, I don't want to use the word mundane, boring, and not creative, but that's kind of like the feeling I get when I look at grid pattern, like strict grids, where like if the whole comic book was like this, it'd be kind of like, you know, I don't know, boring, I guess. <laughs> and this is, oh, look at that boring talky pages. It's almost like you read my mind. 
<clears throat> so he's talking about how you don't want to have just like people talking to each other every single every single panel is just a conversation like you might as well at that point write a novel like I was saying and that's it for uh, chapter 7